Hey, hey, hey guys, this is Hawkeye and I am back with Fishing Sim World and we are here at Boulder Lake and I think what we're going to do guys, we are going to go out on the boat not very far honestly because I have fished over here recently and we're going to see if we can't locate some of the walleye that I had checked out not too long ago. Now, they just recently had a hot fix so that the walleye now it gets XP. That was the only problem with it last time is you could catch them but you didn't get any XP for them which really isn't that good <laughs> I mean it's like I got a trophy and it's like okay so <laughs> didn't get me anywhere but what we're going to do is I'm going to come over here because there's a couple of good spots that had the walleye and this was one of them right here I didn't go very far off of this area right here where those lilies are so we're going to try it again all right now I need to figure out I might still have the carp setting here I don't know so let's check here uh, of course no I don't want that so let's get the bass default go ahead and equip that All right, we're going to use the rattle trap. Start off with that one. Let's see. All right, let's give it a try over here and see if they're out there still. You got to let it go deep, guys. Take it down. To, let's see, how in the world do I do that? Oh yeah, real speed. Take it down to about two. Let it go down to the bottom. And we're going to do this up close and personal here. We'll see if these guys are still here. Or if things have changed. Obviously we stand a good chance of getting bass. Yeah, the first time I went out on there, I found them right away. But I don't, I'm not 100% certain if this was the uh, boat ramp. I knew it was to the right of the boat ramp, but this may not be the right one. But we'll give it a little bit of a try, see what we get. And then if we don't get any, we'll go to one of the other locations and see what we'll see there there we go wow he was well I was not expecting him he came out of nowhere I was about ready to pull it out of the water <laughs> Boy, he is a feisty guy. There we go. I think he's a small mouth. Yep. Well, maybe that's a large mouth. Nope, small mouth. And it's a trophy catch. Well, guys, I don't think I'm getting the walleye here, though. That's the only thing. I think we're going to need to move here. All right, let's see here. All right, guys, we are now at the uh, southeastern location near the boat ramp here. And we're going to give it a try over in this location as well. This may have very well have been where I was at. It, I swear that those two locations look so much alike, it's almost amazing. And it was such a while ago that I did it because I have not been doing the fishing games for a while with the Halloween 
holiday that was going on. There was all kinds of spooky, scary things that I was able to do videos on. So I was kind of doing diff things a little differently for the season. We're going to work this rattle trap a little bit, see if anything goes for it first. Alright, let's see what we got here. It's at least fairly good size. Can't tell just exactly what he is, but let's take the tension down just a tad. He's dark in color, so that's a good sign. He might be a walleye. Walleye usually don't usually don't fight this hard. I don't know, guys. It's hard to tell from the distance. Come on. He's pretty green, though. I think it is a walleye, guys. Nope. It's a bass. Just a very green bass. Trophy smallmouth. Now, if I was trying for smallmouth, I'd be getting the walleye. Now, the last time I was here, that's all I was getting. <laughs> walleye after walleye after walleye. Now, I can't seem to get one to save my soul. Alright, let's take this speed down just a little bit. Alright, guys, I am back. I changed things, or at least the conditions of this location a little bit. I basically changed it to early morning in a clear sky and I do believe I've been seeing some walleye in here so we're going to give it another try here. See if we can't locate one. We just got to be very patient because this is a little deeper here than I expected. Which is probably why they're here. Let's see if we can attract one. Ah, poor strike. Well, hopefully we can keep him. That is a walleye, guys. That is a walleye for sure. I can see his little torpedo shaped body. Come on, big guy. I don't think he's that big, actually. No, he's not too bad. There you go, guys. That's a walleye. That is what they look like. Reach level 17. Now, he is not a trophy. It's only 2 pounds 7 ounces, but not too bad. All right, let's see if we can't get a couple more here. Whoa, okay. Yeah, like I said, this first person's still a little clunky. Yeah, I think I way overthrew it. <laughs> Perfect strike, much better. Okay, this one maybe yeah this one's a little bigger but it is a walleye come on there we go we got him Ooh, now he, this is a nice one. This is a pretty nice one. Four pounds, seven ounces. Still not a trophy. But I'm going to grab a picture of him anyway, just in case. But let's see if we can't find us a trophy here, guys. Yeah, it seems like they are to be found 
early in the morning here. I bet you anything can get them at night too. I'm gonna have to try that just to see. But we'll do that later. Let's try to get that trophy one first. There we go. A little more tension on here. I don't think it's I don't think it's a walleye. I think it may be a bass. Yep. A little bit of a small one. That's a trophy? Huh. Must be right on the edge of it being a trophy. Yeah, I'm going to go back to third person. This is clunky. <laughs> oh, right, we got something here. Should be able to tell. I don't think it's the bass this time. Yeah, the bass fight a lot harder. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is a walleye. But he might be a decent sized one. Alright, we got him. Nope, another bass. Now let's just keep at it. Poor strike. I'm not sure what we got here. Oh, it's a small walleye. Okay, so they do go for this lure. Now he's a little bitty. Yeah, I knew he was a little crappie or something. There we go, perfect strike. I think we might have us another one of those pickerel, but I'm not sure. Yep. Too much slack or something. Well, this guy's big. I think it's a bass, but he's still pretty good size. Damn. Well, 
All right, there we go. He's in. Large mouth, six pounds. I'm sure he'd be a trophy. Another little walleye. Whoa, did you see that fish? <laughs> that was a huge pike. Well, he is not a happy camper. <laughs> Trophy catch, chain pickerel. Drive it, diving crankbait, see if that does anything different. Well, I got something. Oh, well, that's an odd looking crappie. It's so pale. Trophy catch. strike. Looks like the crappie and the pick roll like that one. see what we got here guys this is going to be the last one I'm afraid and I think we have got us a walleye feisty one too nope that's a bass well no trophy walleye this time we did get quite a few fish out of this. This is a really great spot guys. You ought to try this. Just on the southwest uh, teleportation location just to the... I think it's the left. Yeah, it's the left. Just take it right over here where the uh, boat ramp is. Apparently it's a very deep area so the wall I like to hang out here because you're going to see bass, pickerel, 
And I did see a monster pike, but I don't think I have the lure that it was interested in, so I might have to come back here when I purchase some better or bigger lures. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And always remember, guys, aim straight, cast far, and have fun, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.